So one of the things you can do in Advance Wars 1, because this is the only mission you really run into it where you've got multiple armies, um, one of the things you can do with Advance Wars 1 is if you think you're going to lose this mission, you can surrender with Andy. Um, and that'll prevent you from, you know, automatically losing this mission. Um, I don't really suggest doing it that way, but if, you know, say we get into a really bad situation where the medium tank uh, is... medium tank can't be rescued. That's to here, you're gonna get beat up. Just trying to figure out how I'm going to take as many of these, these units out as I can. Oh, so that's not great damage, but um, we have to work with what we got. That's a pretty good exchange there for the uh, the mechanized unit. I could build one more mech. You can go as well. We're gonna send you. I'm gonna send you north. I'm gonna send you north because I think you coming around here and punching these guys in the back uh, are, is gonna be a good move, particularly as we remove these other air units from the area. So that will be... do I want to use my power now? No, I won't use it this turn. Alright, so, as we mentioned before, we set it up so that if he wanted to attack us with his battle copter, he was going to lose the battle copter, which, you know, I'm only, I've only really lost this um, some health in the tank. Uh, let's move you up. Up. And then you can move up. We're gonna drop you off here. We're gonna knights move you up here. You can go here. Drop you back here to heal. You're gonna knights move up to here. You can move up to here. with this entire unit. We should have some decent income once we get all the uh, properties up in this area captured. I'm gonna skip doing any buying anything this turn. Okay, we're gonna capture the whole city. to be smart with these moves because I wanna I wanna try to get in here. This bomber is on my nerves now. In my area, it's on my nerves. Um, Battlecopter, we can, I guess, wait on. Uh, let's see, how much damage? 108, great. So, that is... Put the bomber out of commission. Right, and then... Um, Probably a dead unit, but uh, yeah, it's okay. Up 
here? Why do you always have to have your fucking shit? Not really, because you're gonna get hit real hard. Alright. Pretty much guarantee this area right here where I'm standing is gonna get hit. Um Obviously, because I was pushing with the uh, uh, blue moon, um, but that's not the end of the world here. Uh, if Bombay got knocked out, I would be in kind of a pickle. And then, of course, Andy's units are, you know, on their last leg, and I am. Yeah, I just I need to push with Combi. And Andy can do what Andy can do, and then we'll heal up on our next turn. Okay. So we should be able, hopefully, get uh, Combi Super. He hasn't already gotten it. I wasn't really paying attention to where his superpower was at at the time. Um, but if we can get his superpower, we're gonna put a lot, a lot, a lot of hurt on these units. Um, so let's start out here. I don't need to use Andy's power if I didn't want. If I don't want to. All of his units are already healed. One damage. Get there. Here. Damage. You good? You're gonna die, you're gonna die, you're gonna die, you're gonna die, you're gonna die. I don't think you do enough damage, not nearly. That'll hopefully get us uh, back on the board. Back on the board! I cannot come down here and do any, anything meaningful, so I'm gonna put you here. No, I'm gonna put you here. I'm gonna hope that we can take you out. We're gonna play a fun game, it's called Everybody's Units Get Combined.
be next turn. It'll be in two turns. I'll be able to start pumping out um, rockets. And then you can start capturing that. Uh, I don't need any more infantry, do I? Uh, I can build another infantry. Just for kicks and giggles. Uh, combine is just short. Just short on all occasions. Just short of being here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Um, not terrible though. What can be done? What can be done? Oh, so close. So close. Come by. So close. That'll be that. What did you say? Did you say... Moving up all the units? Oh, that's not great. Maybe we can do to fix that. We do anything to fix that. We can! Do I want to do that? No question. I don't also want to punch you really hard. Um, I must have that would have been sweet. Ooh. Who do I want to take out? threats of this level. Uh, early on it's the uh, air units, then the second wave is these uh, medium tanks and uh, rockets, and then uh, the infantry is sort of like um, fodder for you to have to get in fodder. And that's kind of unfortunate, but we'll just capture. Um, you're gonna go as far north as you can go. Drop you here. You My guy is going to take some damage here. And yeah, let's see what's going up here. Not much. I will keep you out. You out of range. Do I want to keep you out of range? I want to keep you out of range. I will put you here. Eat. And then you guys will move up here. Alright, looking good. Alright, you're gonna stay out of range. Build some stuff here, I think. So these um, 
these places getting captured are not that big of a deal. Um, losing the medium tank, however, would be kind of a big deal. But since I've got other medium tanks hiding in that area, to really just... I mean, combat is just going to put it a freaking... Uh, we're going to have some fun with combat here in a second. Because he's, he's got... He, right now he's sitting on his power, which is giving him increased attack and defense. And, um... I need to get rid of this freaking battle copter. He's driving me nutty. Fashion, um... well, I can't do that, can I? I was gonna say I'm gonna surround you on all sides. I can't do that, so that's okay. We're just gonna, gonna do what we can do. We're gonna surround you. All right. And that's not really gonna make much difference, but it'll make difference in my mind. First casualty of my my war. Here, put an infantry, infantry. Um, and then don't have enough movement to get all the way over here. Too damaged. as far north as you'll go. Think about where you can attack, which is everything. Wing. You can capture here. You can capture here. You can capture here. Backwards. I'm gonna have to... I don't know if this is going to work or not, but at least if it keeps one of these units alive, it'll be worth it. Alright, we can go north. I'm by greatest, greatest butt.
Okay, you're pondering what I'm pondering. I don't know, Brian! Maybe you should have attacked that medium tank, your medium tank, instead of blowing up that air unit. Hmm, let's see here. Can you make it all the way down here? Oh, nope, you can't because I just wasted your turn. So annoying. Like I said, uh, Sturm's uh, push starts to stall um, for a couple different reasons. First of all, as you eliminate his most expensive units, it becomes more and more difficult for him to build up enough uh, in terms of power to use his meteor again. Um, because it's based on the amount of units you lose, the amount of units you defeat, And as you begin to remove battle or, um, bombers, fighters, medium tanks from the from the game, it starts to allow you to stack up um, and really push into firm's area. So we're gonna finally get rid of this guy. What an annoyance! We got another meteor coming on our way because uh, medium tank, medium tank, and uh, fighter, or not fighter, battlecopter, going to add up pretty quickly. And go here. Eight. still alive somehow. So uh, I'm just gonna use you over here. Surprising he's still alive. Typically those units get eaten up by some combination of battlecopter, um, fighter, anti-air. So, let's use Grit Superpower. Um, so I could use the extra range now. Um, and we'll start with the farthest back unit, 87 damage, always wonderful. Well, that'll take care of that guy. 
I'll have to use two more artilleries to take out the other medium tank. That's okay. I believe the Battlecopter will survive here. Because there's, I don't think I can do enough damage with my anti-air. Take him out. Move you one space forward. Alright, 126 damage. That is like that is what I want to see. Alright, and you're gonna move up here. And you can capture that. Getting there slowly. We will finish capturing this. And then I will group cap you or group you guys up. Um, and now I can start building the rockets that I've been talking about. You're gonna stay there, you're gonna stay there. Um, we're going to attempt to uh, use... Um, well, not quite there yet, but... I'm going to try to build up some infantry units down in the bottom corner in the hopes that maybe I can use that to uh, lure away uh, Sturm's meteors in the future. Um, this wouldn't be too bad if he hit here, though. So let's, let's do that. I'm going to put you here. We're going to group up a bunch of guys. Maybe if I'm lucky, he'll hit this area. Um, I'm gonna be careful. Kind of careful, anyways. Okay. Where can you go? Not too far. Uh, you're gonna have to go back for healing. Kombai, you are going to be the MVP of this mission. Let's do that. Okay. Use this back tank first. I'll get a little bit more uh, range on the front on the forward tank. Five, very good. Try to protect some of my other units. I'm going to move you down. Alright, that'll be it for that. Um, this is a board operation. So I'm not going to spend any money with Combi this turn. Um, let's see where Sturm hits with his Meteor Strike. 
Ouch. That is the last place I wanted him to hit. But, it is what it is. my medium tanks except for the damage when I retreated. Yep. There it is. Oh, he took a beating. Take a beating. So, I know, you know, you can definitely cheese, well, I, don't, I don't know if you, it's in the game. You can definitely use the save feature in this game to help mitigate uh, some of this, this trouble where you know, if you save at the beginning of some of like key turns, you could say, okay, that wasn't worth it, let me undo that, and I'll replay the round, uh, you know, with orange, uh, blue, and yellow, so that I don't take that kind of damage. And, you know, obviously the game doesn't punish you. I mean, it's a little, I think it's a little cheap, but uh, the game doesn't punish you for it. It doesn't turn your, you know, save feature off on this mission because it's the last one. You know, it still leaves everything if you wanted to use that uh, to the, you know, fullest of your ability. And uh, that's all good. You're going to move up here. Going cap. You're going to come here, you're going to capture here. But regardless, he's going to do some pretty big damage. Um, no matter what you try to do. So, I'm going to... Okay. Alright, I had to ease. Here, back you off a little bit. Here, move up to here. You guys can just move. Oh, no, we wanted to make a. Um, we wanted to make a fort of you guys. All right, so gone by. Did not take the bait of these uh, infantry units, so uh, we're just gonna use what we got. Yeah. You don't want to find my infantry units? That's fine. Fine, no one cares. I care. But um, yeah, we're gonna put you here so we can start healing. Uh, I got enough for a medium tank. Means I got to probably. Uh, I've got more than enough for me. Thanks. I got enough for a bomber. We're gonna start popping bombers out here in a second. You can come over here and shoot that. everybody. 
medium tank's gonna hurt me on my next turn. That's a doki. Mind. We're gonna start paying it back. Maybe I should think about just making battle mat or uh, yeah, battle copters. Those would hurt these medium tanks pretty good, but at the same time, these anti airs would crunch me. Mm, I'll think about it while I I'll mull it over in the next turn. And we'll build a tank. I like tanks. Tank, tank, tank. We win the game. We build lots of tanks. How you lose the game is you put your tanks in range of other tanks. That's how you lose the game. Another way, good way to lose it is to put yourself in range of, um, of, um, okay, I believe you're going to slaughter my, um, anti-airs, that's one, the other one is still alive, no, nope, he's dead. But you can see why this... Another thing that's really frustrating about this mission is, you know, I am an hour and ten minutes into this recording, and, you know, I've probably got a good 15 minutes to half an hour left to finish off this mission. Um, okay, so I guess now's the time to pop the power holding on to it probably too long. Alright, so let's see here. First things first. Go home. Second. So disappointed. Like I was gonna defeat everybody. No, I can't. Cause I stink. And get here. Good. Push in with these mechanized units. They said they're cheap. They hit like tanks. Um. Forward. These battle copters drive me nutty. And you still leave my battle copter alive. Not very smart when you leave battle copters alive. He do 85 damage to you. Idea. Rock to be sweet. I have rockets though. Brit, it is your turn. We are going to make you man. to use artillery. When we are done using artillery, we will lose more artillery. I don't even have to do that, actually. I can actually just move up here like this. Embarrassing! Good 
is you can only push up to there. I'm gonna build another rocket. You're gonna push up. We will push you up to here because I'm not building anything in there. So we'll push you up, you can move north. That's all done. Bumbai, what happened? You sacrificed all my medium tanks, Christopher. You shouldn't have done that, you dummy. I redeemed myself by building lots and lots of uh, battlecopters, or perhaps just one bomber. That might be good. You're still an idiot. Well, this will redeem me a little bit, I guess. Wink! bring you over here just to block out. Yeah, it should be that. Alright, now we're gonna start to push inward um, his... Uh, medium tank's gonna move down here in a second. Take... Uh, okay. Well, that makes sense, kinda. Not really. I mean, it, it makes sense insofar as it's the, the one-hit kill, you know, and it, but at the same time, it's like, I've got a line of artillery just waiting to take out this very expensive medium tank. So you're not in range. You are. So we'll do that. We'll do 78 damage to you. He's dead. You're dead. Um, you're still alive somehow. Which is very surprising. I'm just gonna use you to take uh, out these guys. Um, capture. You're gonna capture. You're gonna capture. You're gonna capture. Boy, if I was playing as Sammy right now, this would be freaking devastating for Sturm. Well, not really, but I like to pretend it would be. 14 damage. 14 damage. Oh well, yeah, let's do this. We're not going to worry about anything else. Do that. You're going to move... You're going to move up here. I'm going to move you up here like this. You're blocked in. You can't go anywhere. And, um... Rocket time? Rocket time. Medium time. Medium. Uh, I'll put you there. You can go here. You're staying. That'll be the end of that. Uh, we're gonna wipe this medium tank off the face of the earth. First. Build more infantry. Always important. Oh no, you're in my range! Who would have thunk it? The grid is pretty hard countered on this side, or any side, uh, by battlecopters. So if battlecopters start coming this direction, you have to have uh, either this or something similar to it uh, in waiting.
Though they changed uh, Derm's design in the next game in uh, Advance Wars 2. Um, he looks more like Darth Vader in Advance Wars 2. But um, in this game, I think he kind of looks like a squid. I mean, he's got like that, you know, atypical or typical, you know, the way they draw their squids with the little honk noses. Interested the way they're going to design him in Advance Wars reboot. They're just going to have one sprite, or if they're going to do the two sprites again, where they're going to have the Advance Wars 1 Sturm sprite and then a Advance Wars 2 Sturm sprite. You know, stay true to the original. I don't really care one way or the other. If they wanted to just do one sprite for both games, it wouldn't hurt my feelings. It wouldn't even bother me, actually. As long as, as long as they don't make Sturm look like an idiot. I mean, that's true of everybody. As long as you don't make all of the characters look like freaking idiots. So, you can only go up to here. Let's here. 14 damage, is that enough? It is. Good. Good, good, good. Go in. Or eighty. Where can you go? Not nothing. Uh, I'll put you here. Do seventy damage. Quite there yet. However, I'm gonna keep pumping tanks out with him. If he put does something that tells me to stop doing that with all these anti with all these anti airs, it does not say stop. It says keep going. You unfortunately need to stay where you're at and continue to heal. Man, Sturm, you get another frickin' meteor strike. That's ridiculous. Ugh. Ugh. Kinda of okay, I guess. Picked a very expensive spot to... Medium strike. I don't mind. 